Hello friends, welcome back to Infigyan. Today in this video, we have one very very interesting question from Radical Mathematics. Here we have to evaluate expression 243x power 6 plus 40x. Let's say this required expression is E. Now we will begin with given 1 over x. We can write 7 as root 7 times root 7. We can write root 91 as root 7 times root 13. 7 root 7 we will write as it is. And then we have 7 root 13 which we can write root 7 times root 7. This is 7 times root 13. In denominator we will write 14 as 2 times 7. So I will write 2 times root 7 times root 7. Root 91 we will write root 7 times root 13. And root 7 we will write as it is. Now we will take root 7 common from numerator and denominator. So we will write 1 over x will be equal to root 7 times. In the bracket we will write root 7 plus root 13 plus 7 plus root 7 times root 13 which is root 91 in the numerator and in the denominator we will be writing root 7 common out in the bracket to root 7 plus root 13 plus 1. Now root 7 will be over from numerator and denominator. Now we can write our numerator here. I will write root 13 plus root 7. Then I will write 7 plus root 91. In denominator, we will write 2 root 7 as root 7 plus root 7. Then we have root 13 plus 1. Now I will write here 1 common from first two terms from these two. I will write in the bracket root 13 plus root 7. From last two terms in the numerator we will take root 7 common. So I will write here root 7 common out. So in the bracket there will be root 7 plus root 13. In denominator I will write root 13 first. Then root 7. Again root 7. Then we have plus 1. Now we will take root 13 plus root 7 common from the numerator. So I will write 1 over x equal to root 13 plus root 7. In other bracket we will get root 7 plus 1. In denominator we will write root 13 plus root 7 plus root 7 plus 1. Now I will switch numerator and denominator. So consider reciprocal both sides, we will get x in LHS. In RHS, we will write root 13 plus root 7 plus root 7 plus 1. And denominator will be numerator which is root 13 plus root 7 times root 7 plus 1. Now I will split our numerator with respect to denominator. So I will put bracket here. Now we can write, we will get root 13 plus root 7 will be cancelled out. We will write 1 over root 7 plus 1. Plus root 7 plus 1 will be cancelled out this time. So we will write 1 over root 13 plus root 7. Now we will rationalize our denominator. So I will multiply here with 
root 7 minus 1. So I need to write here also root 7 minus 1. Here I will multiply root 13 minus root 7. So I need to multiply in the numerator root 13 minus root 7. Now in denominator we are getting one algebraic form a plus b times a minus b. So I will write here root 7 minus 1 over root 7 is square minus 1 is square and here we will write root 13 minus root 7 over root 13 is square minus root 7 is square. This will be equal to root 7 minus 1 over 7 minus 1 which is 6 plus root 13 minus root 7 over 13 minus 7 which is again 6. So I will write here x equal to the common denominator is 6. So I will write here root 7 minus 1 plus root 13 minus root 7. Now we can cancel plus and minus root 7 from numerator and we can write x will be equal to root 13 minus 1 over 6. This is the value of x. Now we have to prove or find this expression. So I will cross multiply first. 6x equal to root 13 minus 1. Now I will write 6x plus 1 equal to root 13. Now we can consider squaring both sides. Now square root and square will be cancelled out. I will get LHS will apply a plus b whole square formula. So I can write 36x square plus 12x plus 1 equal to 13 or I can write 36x square plus 12x equal to 12. Let's divide both sides by 12. We will get x square times 3 plus x equal to 1 or I can write 3x square will be equal to 1 minus x. Or we can write x square equal to 1 minus x over 3. Now I will rewrite this equation here. 3x square equal to 1 minus x. As per our expression, x power 6 is required. So I will consider cubing both sides so that we will get x power 6. So I will write par 3, par 3. Now LHS will become 3 cube times x square whole cube which will be equal to 27x par 6. Now we have to apply a minus b whole cube formula in RHS. So we will write 1 cube is 1 minus x cube minus 3x in the bracket 1 minus x. Now I can write minus x cube. This will be written as x times x square. Then we will write minus 3x. Then we will write plus 3x square. Now you can see 3x square is 1 minus x. So here we are going to write 1 minus x. And here we will apply the value of x square. So I will write 1 minus x times 1 minus x over 3. This is x square minus 3x and then 3x square is 1 minus x. So this will be equal to 1 plus 1 is 2 minus x minus 3x minus 4x minus x times 1 minus x over 3. Now I will take LCM. So I can write 
6 minus 12x, let me write here, 27x power 6 equal to 6 minus 12x minus x times 1 minus x. Now denominator will be common denominator 3. Now I can write RHS as 1 over 3. In bracket we will write 6 minus 12x minus x plus x square. Now we will apply the value of x square which is 1 minus x over 3. So I can write here 6 minus 13x plus x square will be equal to 1 over 3 times 6 minus 13x plus 1 minus x over 3. Again we will take LCM. So I will write here 1 over 9. Here we will write 18 minus 13 times 3. So I will write here 39x plus 1 minus x. Now minus 39 minus x is minus 40 plus 19. So I will write here 27x power 6 will be equal to 1 over 9 in the bracket will write 19 minus 40 x. Now we will multiply both sides by 9. So 9 times 27 x power 6 will be equal to 19 minus 40 x. Now 9 times 27 is 243 x power 6 equal to 19 minus 40 x. So I can write 243 x power 6 plus 40 x will be equal to 19. So our required expression E will be equal to 19. Let me write here also our answer will become E equal to 19. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to hype, like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care. Goodbye.